is the best person I have ever met. My name is Luciana, and we are here to celebrate Christmas. So Merry Christmas! Merry Christmas to you, all, my friends! Hello, my dear amigos. Welcome to your channel. And first of all, Merry Christmas. And I am here in Aroka. और इस बार मैं क्रिसमस मनाने जा रही हूँ अपनी बेस्ट फ्रेंड के साथ में जो कि पोर्चुगल से है पोर्चुगीज वे में हम लोग क्रिसमस सेलिब्रेट करेंगे तो देखते हैं ये लोग क्या खाते हैं कैसे सेलिब्रेट करते हैं तो आज है क्रिसमस ईव 24 दिसंबर पोर्टो से एक घंटे की जर्नी करके हम पहुंचे अरोका और हमने शुरू की खाना बनाने की तैयारी तो क्रिसमस पे ये लोग खाते हैं बकरियाओ फिश जो कि बहुत फेमस है पोर्चुगल में और पोटेटोज इस तरीके से बनाया जाता है बकरियाओ यहाँ पे टेबल एकदम रेडी है खाना खाने के लिए डिनर होता है क्रिसमस ईव पे तो बर्तन धोने के लिए सही है यहाँ पर तो बकलिया बनकर तैयार है और इसे इस तरह से सजाया जाता है और टेबल पर सब खाने के लिए भी तैयार है और बढ़िया से खाने के बाद डिजर्ट में खाया जाता है ये केक यहाँ पर है चेस्टनट ये लोग क्रिसमस पे चेस्टनट बहुत खाते हैं रात को पूरा डिनर करके हम लोग सोए थे और अभी सुबह उठे फिर से बना रहे हैं और फिर से टेबल रेडी किया है तो मीन्स यही है क्रिसमस खाना तो आज है ट्वेंटी फिफ्थ दिसम्बर बनाया जा रहा है ये डिश On the Christmas Eve, as you know, maybe in Portugal, we eat the boiled potatoes with how do you call it in English? The bacalha, bacalha, no, these greens. Okay, cauliflower. No, it's not cauliflower. Okay, it's these greens which in Portuguese we call pinkas, which are very traditional in 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 Portugal. So we boil the potatoes, the pinkas. The um, uh, eggs, the um, codfish, and then we eat like that on the Christmas Eve, mm -hmm. all boiled. But on the day after, which is today, we use the leftovers, and uh, as you can see here, yeah, for apple value in English means like, which like a uh, old thing, like um, for apple yeah, value, value is old, value is old, exactly. Mm -hmm. But for apple, it's like um, for example. You have a cloth, and it's old, so it's a frap veil. It's called like um, it's something uh, as not new, not new, exactly. new it's fresh no. leftovers. But you know, even so, this is like old. It's from yesterday because yesterday was fresh. I loved it. We eat the frap veil, mm -hmm. and some others will eat this uh, roasted um, uh, meat. And my sister also did rice. Okay, rice with. Just uh, plain rice. Plain okay, rice. plain rice. And ah, and uh, Barty like Indian uh, dessert. Did this with the uh, carrots, yes. and dry fruits, and sugar, right? Yes. This, this is perfect. gajar ka halwa. Nice. What? Gajar ka halwa. Ah, it's the name. Yes. Okay, perfect. <laughs> and you can you can come to see the other things. Ah, the um, Barty this this lovely. Uh, moon, uh, uh, moon dal. Uh, moon dal bread. Yes. Lovely, lovely. I will, I will love it very much. Then my aunt yesterday did this. Um, we call it in Portuguese. Um, oh God. Ah, this is a um, bowl de rose. Ah, bowl de rose. Exactly like it's like rice, rice cake. Rice cake. And this is like. Um, A very good, very nice traditional and regional bread here from Aroca region. Okay. It's really nice. It's called padinhas in Portuguese. Padinhas. Padinhas. It comes like uh, the name padinhas comes from pão. Okay. And padinhas because they are small, you know, mm -hmm. small and sweet. Okay. So padinhas. And then come, come, come. You will see. We have more. And then here. Ooh, 
wow. And we have fruit. Ah, uh, this is a part of our bed and breakfast. And here it's fruit. And my brother also bought on a bakery these, which is called, um, you see, which is called Bolo Rainha. Mm. Rainha é uh, um... Queen. Queen. Yes. Exactly. It's called like um, okay. cake queen, cake. Mm. and it's very nice. And yeah, that's that's what we will eat. The view we have. Ah, this the beautiful view. view. Wait, 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 wait. Wow. Where we are? Ah, we are in a in a village mm -hmm. called Aroca. Uh, my family, most it was mostly them, no, not me because I was not here at the time. They created um, this bed and breakfast called, as you can see from the, that yeah. board, Casa do Milhaço. So mm -hmm. part of the house we use for bed and breakfast purposes. You can see, uh, you can come and you can see the rest of the place. Ah, let's go. Ah, here is the place. Unfortunately, my father died in 2017, but here was the place where they would um, he, wa he uh, would pr produce wine because my my father was a wine producer there was um like a small tank mm -hmm. where my father would produce the wines and the um, the things where you would put the, the wine inside which i don't know the name in english it would called uh, barril mm -hmm. barril de vinho the wine like in, i don't know the name like sorry. a ten it was some kind it's of a, a wine tank when my father would put the, mm -hmm. the, the wine inside to mature and a lot of people would, would love his wine. So like on summer all these, uh, these things are full of, um, of how do you say? Of, grapes. Uh, grapes, exactly, and of, of um, how do you call these? Uh, vineyards. Vineyards, yes. They, they are full of vineyards and then you can come here we have We are very fortunate and very privileged to have a mine where it comes water oh. from the mountains. Yay, so wow. this water is sacred for us because it's such a fresh water and Indeed. good water. So we love this water because it comes from a mine and from the mountains directly. Yeah, so we are, very, we are very privileged and as I was telling you, these tanks serve these two purposes like watering the land Yes, and as well it can uh, for summer for our guests to refresh themselves. My family put here so many hours of labor, of love. Really love this house and this house is really special for us. So, and uh, yeah, come, come, if not to our house, no problem, but come to visit uh, Aroka. Aroka. A beautiful place. Now we are going to go to Aroka Ghumne. रास्ते में हमने विजिट किया अरोका जोह पार्क के फॉसिल म्यूजियम को जहां पर 300 मिलियन साल से भी पहले सिर्फ समुद्र हुआ करता था और यहां पर आज भी समुद्री जीवों के जीवाश्म जो कि डायनासोर से भी पुराने हैं उन्हें संरक्षित करके रखा गया है और फिर हम गए दुनिया के सबसे लंबे पेडेस्ट्रियन सस्पेंशन ब्रिज के पास जो कि 516 मीटर ऊंचाई पर है और 175 मीटर लंबा है और पाइवा रिवर के किनारों को जोड़ता है तो हम है अरोका में और ये है यहाँ पर पाइवा नदी और इस तरफ है मेरे पाइवा वॉकवे और इसके ऊपर जाकर के हम पहुंचेंगे दुनिया के सबसे बड़े दुनिया के सबसे बड़े ब्रिज पर जो कि पैदल यात्रियों के लिए है ये जो शहर है अरोका वो पहले फेमस था यहाँ के चर्चेस के लिए नेचुरल ब्यूटी के लिए लेकिन उसके बाद जब ये ब्रिज बना तो ये ब्रिज चार चांद लगाता है इस इस धरती पर और आप देख ही रहे हैं कि कितना खूबसूरत है ये क्रिसमस के ट्रेडिशनल सेलिब्रेशन के बाद न्यू ईयर का धमाकेदार सेलिब्रेशन भी बनता है
आपको वीडियो अच्छा लगा है तो प्लीज़ वीडियो को लाइक कीजिए शेयर कीजिए कमेंट कीजिए और अगर आप मेरे चैनल पर नए हैं तो चैनल को सब्सक्राइब कीजिए